So I'm digging in the backyard, I'm putting in some new plants, and uh, I hit something. I dug up um, a dirty old trash bag, and I had torn it open as I was digging with the shovel, and <clears throat> dirt spilled out and a bunch of small bones, um, which makes me unhappy. Um, and then I found beside it an, a, uh, another bag, um, but I was able to pull that one out intact, and now I'm scared to open it because I don't want to see what's inside. Um, I think it might be a cat. I don't know. Um, bag number two was very, very bad. Very bad. Uh, it's not as far along in the process. <laughs> yeah, I was right. It, uh, I was right. It was, yeah. Um, yeah. It was a cat. And it's... Here's some of the little bones I found belonging to cat number one. I have not located his skull, but it's somewhere. It's the circle of life. And it moves us so. I think what we're looking at here is bag number three. Good gravy. Yep. That's three. There's number four. It's number five right there. And it's starting to get pretty depressing. Five was accompanied by number six. After uh, digging up my sixth cat carcass of the day, my wife informed me that um, uh, dead cats release some kind of chemicals that uh, from her tone I gathered were not uh, good chemicals. And so now I've got the mask going. And um, I'm going to keep digging. I've dug six holes so far and I found six cats. So I'm going to dig about three more in this area. In the, what I guess was the cat graveyard. And um, so I'm putting the over under it, uh, ten cats that I'll find today. Um, you know, some people are saying like, oh, that's so hor horrifying, you know. There's all these dead animals buried in your backyard. But when I move into a new home, I'm always hoping that I'll find um, one after another. Just cat bodies, cat bodies, cat bodies. I'm gonna keep looking for cats. So first thing I did was I cleared the gravel or the stones off of the, that area as best I could. And now I'm gonna start the digging proper, working my way from left to right. Let's see what we find. So I decided to start digging again and um, cleared out all the rocks and I've started and so far I'm about a third of the way through the area and how many cats do you think I've found? How many cats in trash bags? I've found eight. Eleven cats I've found so far. So I put all the rocks over here. I started digging here, worked my way along. And over there where the shovel is, which is where I found cat number 11. And I still have all of this territory to cover. So what do you think? Do you think we're gonna find 20 cats today? Of course we are.
beat it. That's cat number 25 right there, so I've brought in some reinforcements. Mr. Max Osinski. What do we got? You found 25 cats just here? Just right here. Just here? Just in the area I've dug up right here. I think I got another one. Are you sure? I'm paw Sativ. You've got the magic touch. Ooh. It makes me glow so much. Ooh. It can. It's the final I'm headed over to House of Intuition now to see if they can have any, I don't know, crystals or stones or something that can fucking appease cat ghosts, I don't know. I just spent $92 on total fucking horse shit. I drop one of these bad boys in each of the corners of the cat area. That should cleanse it, cleanse it, you know? Pretty good at least. This guy's gonna be working overtime. Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road Time grabs you by the rest, directs you where to go So make the best of this test and don't ask why It's not a question but a lesson learned in time It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life So take the photographs and still friends in your mind Hanging on a shelf in good health and good time Tattoos and memories and dead skin on trial For what it's worth, it was worth all the while It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life Oh, I forgot to tell you that I found seven more cats today, which brings the total to
I decided to put some plants in the unexplored area. There's more. Fuck. Hey, so I realized I left you with sort of a cliffhanger last week regarding cat bodies, and I wanted to fill you in. Basically, I was digging in that unexplored area, immediately found a bag, and decided to drop my shovel and walk away because I... As I'm sure you can imagine, I've grown tired of finding dead cats in my yard and I needed a little breather. So I'm rested, feel energized, focused, and I'm ready to get back at it. So Sunday at 10 a.m. and get some friends over and we're gonna get after it, you know? Uh, who knows what we'll find? One, two, 10? I'm, I'm hoping it's one, but uh, I hope it's an anticlimactic uh, dig sesh. Anyways, pals, friends, if you're out there and you're watching and you own a shovel and you want to see what it's like to dig up some dead cats, please join me 10 a.m. on Sunday. Happy Memorial Day. It's fitting, you know, Memorial Day weekend. To those who remain behind has left this day of memories. Pretty sure a cat wrote that. So we're redoing some of the walkways at our place and redoing our driveway. So today they came to demo all the concrete for these paths, right? And they uh, did the path in the back of the house right by the unexplored area. So you can see they demoed this path along here. This is the area in question. But already just along the perimeter, We've got a bag, 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 bag. We got cat bodies, people. Number one for today, number two, and number three. <laughs> this one's deep. I told it to a putty tap. <laughs> Shake it off. And Shake it off. That's number four. Oh, 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 sorry, sorry. Number five. Number six, and Dingo just found number seven. Ta-da! Cat. Ah, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> number eight. Lives. Well, this one's not alive anymore. Um, that's number nine. What's Num like a pun number, on the, What like we thought was number nine was just Ted a farce, Bundy, false like... alarm. Just b b big old bundle of... It's a what, what you do. Cats. Oh my god. It's number 10. Oh god. At least you guys don't have to right? Or number 11? It's 11. 11.
Possible murder weapon, cat lady, in the backyard, with the creepy knife. Hello? Are you ready? I'm just a cat that likes to have fun Long lazy days I lie in the sun I'm just a cat as quiet as a mouse So let me in, open your house I'm just a cat, let me concur No need to fight 